College will be different this year. Some students will take all of their classes online. Others will be in the classroom. Well, some will have a mixed schedule. <laughs> 27 First News reporter Carolyn Sistrand visited two Western Pennsylvania schools as students are getting ready for classes. College students across Pennsylvania are returning to school this week, including at Westminster College. Education and what we do with our students is really important, and so I do really believe folks will, will do what we need to do. Vice President of Student Affairs and Dean of Students Gina Vance says that the majority of their freshmen chose to come in person. On top of wearing masks and social distancing, moving into the dorms looked a little different this year. But Vance says that wasn't a bad thing. Some of the feedback from our parents who quite frankly have older students who have seen us do it in other ways, really enjoyed the time and the space to be able to, to move in without such the congestion that we might typically have. Yeah, I feel very assured uh, you know, with everything happening. Over at Teal College, senior Sam Faber says he was pleased with the communication from the school about returning to campus. The school's president, Susan Traverso, told me that they've made the changes to the spacing in common areas and classrooms, and they've also modified each course taught in person to also be available online. If we need to have a student uh, needs to be isolated or uh, quarantined, they could, he or she could continue seamlessly to study. Uh, and if uh, we do need to shift to online, we're ready to go. Traverso is confident that the staff and students will make these changes work. We can make these adjustments to still be in community and uh, have a sense of togetherness while uh, we protect ourselves and other people from this pandemic. Classes for both schools begin on Monday. Carolyn Sistrand, WKBN 27 First News.